congratulations. Uh, first win of the series, first Super League win. How are you feeling? Yeah, no, this is a special one, um, especially as it's after the Olympics, and I've, I've not struggled, but I've not quite been back where I want to be, and, and this is kind of, it's been a progression to, to get here, and, and yeah, I can't, can't quite believe it, to be honest, after kind of being on the back burner for, for most of the race, they finally come in with about 400 metres to go into the race, it's pretty, pretty cool, and um, yeah, yeah, really tough. Can you talk us through how the race went? Because it was a... Uh perhaps a slower start and you built into it a little yeah, bit that, yeah yeah I um, had an okay swim I was there or thereabouts off onto the bike and uh, around that first roundabout uh, Aaron Royal crashed in front of me and uh, it shook me up a little bit and I lost a little bit of time on that first bike but managed to run myself back into the mix and then um, yeah just just kind of stay there or thereabouts for the rest of the race and managed to find my flow through the corners and stuff like that and then um, yeah I mean, it's a technical bike course as well, this one, isn't it? There's some big accelerations, there's some tight turns, tight corners. You must have been pretty pleased with your handling as well today. Yeah, I mean, initially, no, after the first, on the first bike, I was a bit sh shaken up after that crash. Um, uh, it's never nice to see somebody come down. It's never nice for that to happen to anyone. Um, and yeah, for me, just seeing that happen, I was just a bit more cautious and... Uh, it took me a bit of time to find my flow again, but once I got on a group and was following a wheel, it started to become more natural, and yeah, it was it was good. Going into the, the third round of a swim bike run, did you at that point were you thinking, yeah, I, I could win this, or was it later into the into the race? For me, I was just racing the, the, each 30 seconds at a time, and that was the way I, I think I managed to stay in the race. Is just focusing on the 30 seconds in front of me, making sure I was smooth in the right gear coming into transition to turning my bike around putting my helmet in the right place putting my shoes where they need to be and i think those things were the reason why i was i was still there was because i'd maybe lose a little bit of time on the swim or or in a in transition but i made made those right decisions and that kept me there or thereabouts and allowed me to use my run in the end i know you said previously that some of the the little minor details were the things that had kind of going against you or let you down a little bit in the previous races had you ironed all those out this week were you thinking about that coming into this race yeah definitely i mean for me super league's been all about learning and getting things right and making mistakes and then learning from them and i guess the progression from fifth in london to third in munich to, to first here is like showed that like those things do make a difference and i wouldn't say i'm any fitter or any maybe a format suits me a little bit better but certainly i think one of the things i've improved on the most is just getting those little things right and the championship overall is wide open after this race. There's, there's plenty to play for still going to the last race in Malibu where there's also extra points on offer. Oh, I didn't so know that. How are oh. you? <laughs> well, you must be happy. I was going to say, how are you <laughs> feeling about that? But you must be happy now you know. Yeah, no, that's cool. Um, uh, yeah, for, for me, it's, uh, I'll enjoy this one and process this and then maybe look to, look to the future in a few days. Um, but we've got a few days here on the island and I really want to appreciate that. And, um, and then, yeah, we can um, knuckle down and think about the next race. And how about the crowds here? Uh, you probably, you've raced here once before, but obviously so many of the athletes say this is their favourite race on the calendar because of the crowds, the community, the support, the course, everything about it. How did you find it today? Yeah, I absolutely love it here. It's uh, one of the most beautiful settings for a triathlon I think there is. It's almost Monaco-esque uh, yeah. here. And, um, yeah, the crowds that come out here are always electric and... I've seen it from both sides. I came to watch my girlfriend live here, uh, race here in 2019, and then race myself in 2018. So, I, yeah, I've absolutely loved it both times, whether I've been racing or, or spectating. So, I definitely recommend coming down here to, to watch a race if you're going to watch any. Well, congratulations, Alex. A fantastic performance today and a great win, and we'll see you in Malibu. Thank you very much. Cheers.